Uh, I continue to meet with and listen to our students, our faculty, and our staff. Uh, I can say that uh, our, motion, uh, our emotions are swinging like a pendulum. Uh, it appears sometimes at one moment that people are fine, and then the next moment it feels like they're being knocked down by a tidal wave of grief and pain. It's going to be a while before we get to whatever we can consider normal. Commencement is one of the most special days in the day of this university. And I think after one of the worst days, or <coughs> the worst day in the day of this university, it's appropriate, even though it's difficult, that we continue on and be able to celebrate our graduates' academic dreams fulfilled. I hope we will also remember her for her multiple talents. Now I'll go with a triple threat artist. She was a professional concert pianist who left that career due to physical disabilities. She embroidered beautifully, creating her own designs. And every holiday season, she brought us her homemade chocolates. Pat immediately made a positive impact in the lives of students and her colleagues. She had a larger-than-life personality, an infectious smile, and a genuine kindness that made everyone around her feel like family. She loved gatherings, the more the merrier, she would say. She loved baking and sharing, especially dessert items. Her creme brulee and macarons were, were not to be missed. Jerry was a rigorous researcher and a good teacher who deeply love his student at UNLV. In fact, he loved UNLV so much that he and his wife discussed some time ago the idea that he would like to donate his body to research at UNLV. The officers involved in this officer-involved shooting are identified as Detective Nathaniel Drum, D-R-U-M, and Officer Damien Garcia. In a word, these two officers are heroes. They kept the worst from becoming a bloodbath. 